Welcome to Violet's Violet's. So what is an urban safari? You can't stage nature. It doesn't work that way, but you can appreciate what's going on, whether you were there or not. You can take a moment, you can look up, you can see what's going on, you can appreciate it, and then you leave it there and you walk away. I don't go looking for anything specific. I just see what happens. And that's when I find the best things. And that's what life's really about, being in the moment and being able to appreciate what's going on right under your nose, whether you're aware of it or not. For me, that's what the urban safari is. It's also capturing what I love around me in those rare moments that I normally have, which I can now share with everyone else. And thankfully, my lovely little new camera is quite on for the journey. I hope you enjoy this, and if there's anything specific you'd like to see, let me know. There's quite a few things on my list, and when I do find them, I will film them. So if there's anything else you'd like me to add, let me know. Thanks. This tree in front of me has something purple on it. Let's go see what that is. I hope it's not rubbish. I really hope it's not rubbish. Hey, Zoe. That is rubbish. Lovely people. Okay, I'm going to clean that up. This is a little game I play that can only happen once a day. The morning sun's still rising high and without the camera it hurt my eyes. I hope you like this little game Cause I'm not giving up on it again Zoe's been exploring the forage zone and looking for her magic spot. And in part the reason I really like this is I love looking at trees from underneath. There's part of, I just feel safe and calm under a tree. It's like everything stops outside for a while. So. I've been uh, playing with this new style a little bit, so let me know what you think. I quite enjoy it, but it may not be your cup of tea. Um, and hey, in the meantime, it's, it's a bit pretty. And in part, it's change of perspective. Let me know if you'd like me to do more of these or if you'd like me to speed them up a little bit. I won't do them all the time, but I will when something particular catches my eye or the light's right or whatever it is at the time. This is obviously a really nice old pine tree. And I particularly like the way it met the ground. Like that orb splitting in three.
This is another young pine that was planted next to the bunya pine that I filmed the other day. I particularly like how it looks at the top and the symmetry and the way it's growing. It's quite beautiful. I'm slowly exploring the rest of the park. I haven't even touched the edges of it yet. And let me know if you like these as well. I find them really interesting. I can also start to add more information about the different plants, animals, things that I'm seeing if you'd like as well. It's easy for me to do so. Um, so let me know and I'll make it soon. Then I spotted the horse. I'll do that in the next video. And a seriously good slow motion tail swat.